Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, welcome. So I'm super excited about today's video. We are actually doing another Timu haul. As always, I found a lot of great stuff and I can't wait to share with you. So I have some accessories, clothing, hair tools, which I'm really excited about, um, and some other fun stuff. Also, I say this in pretty much every single Timu video, but if you're gonna be doing some shopping on Timu, I definitely recommend downloading the app. I just find it's a much smoother shopping experience and you also get more perks. So I definitely recommend downloading the app. Also, I do have a coupon for you guys. So every user existing and new users on Timu can use this code. I'm going to have the link down below in the description bar. Um, so everything for that is going to be down in the description. So yeah, if you want to save some money, definitely check my link down below. Also, every user can check out special items priced under a dollar every day by clicking my link as well. So you're definitely going to want to do that. But anyways, enough chit chat. Let's go ahead and get into this Timu haul. Okay, so I think I'm going to go ahead and start with clothing first. This one right here might just be the best skim soup that I've ever found and I can't wait to show you. It it literally looks and feels just like the Skims one. It's insane. So it's this really cute set. It's just a black long sleeve. Nothing too crazy about it, but I'm obsessed with it, you guys. Like so basic, so plain, but I love it. Um, so yeah, just a basic black long sleeve. And then we have the matching bottoms right here. So this is what they look like here. These are the ones that you actually go ahead and roll the waistband down. And they do have a tiny little flare at the bottom there. But oh my goodness, you guys, if you're looking for a good Skims dupe, this one right here. This is the best that I've ever found. Like, I'm honestly blown away by how good it actually is. Like, I knew it was gonna be good, but I didn't know it was gonna be this good, you know what I mean? I don't know if they had other colors in the set or not, but if they do, I definitely wanna go back and get those as well. But I'm really glad that I just got plain black because you can really, like, dress this up or dress this down. Like, there's so much that you can do with a set like this. Throw on a really cute coat, do some fun accessories, or you could wear it just like this with some basic Uggs and that's super cute as well. So yeah, I am absolutely obsessed with this. I think I got this in a size extra small. Let me double check. Yeah, so I went ahead and I got the set in a size extra small and it fits amazing, definitely true to size, but you guys, I definitely recommend checking this set out because it's so good and I'm just in love with this. All right, next one. I also love to keep their bags. I said this in another video, but I love these reusable bags like this with the seal. I just think they're great. This is another one that I genuinely could not get over the quality when I open it up. So again, it's another basic. It's just a plain kind of like heather gray long sleeve. But the quality on this one, you guys, it's actually really thick and like soft and it's also nice and stretchy. I'm gonna show you guys up close just so you can see a little bit better. Now this one, I know for a fact they did have different colors, but I just love this gray. I don't have a long sleeve in this color. So I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and get it. And I'm so glad that I did. Let me check the sizing on this. So again, I got this in a size extra small. And again, it fits great. It's not like super, super tight and restricting. It does have a little bit of like, give to it, which I like because sometimes I find with long sleeves, especially if they're too tight, they can kind of hurt around like the armpit area. But yeah, I really, really like the fit of this. It's so nice, so comfortable. I just love having basics like this in my closet. I feel like you can never have enough. And I feel like this is gonna look so nice with just some jeans or even like a cute pair of sweatpants. Again, I might go back and get some more colors because this top is just amazing. And next we have kind of a biggie. You guys know how much I love my matching sweatsuits. It's kind of an obsession. I'm not gonna lie, but it's fine. <laughs> so I went ahead and picked up another one. It's just this plain black crew neck style. And again, you guys, the quality is so nice. It's super thick. And on the inside, it's nice and like fuzzy. It's kind of like a little fleecy material. I don't know if you guys can see that. And of course it does come with the matching sweatpants right here. So nothing too crazy about these. They do have a little cuff at the bottom there um, and they are drawstring at the top. I do have a uh, set just like this, but it does have like a saying on the front. So I just wanted something super plain and basic because I do wear that other one so much. It's definitely reached for a lot. So I just wanted something that didn't have any saying or graphic on it. And I'm so happy with this. I love it so much. It's so comfy, you guys. Once you put this on, you're not gonna wanna take it off. <laughs> so I actually got this one in a size medium. When it comes to my sweatsuits, I typically like to size up just for that like, uh, bag your look and I really really love the fit of this. It's definitely I would say a true medium for sure So um, you definitely could get your regular size But if you're like me and you like something a little bit more loose fitting when it comes to your sweatsuits I would size up for sure. But again, highly highly recommend this Okay, next I picked up a purse and this is one that I've actually been eyeing for like such a long time And I'm so happy that I finally got it So it's probably gonna be a little bit hard to show right now But what I might do is include a clip of it with like 
stuff in it because right now it's just flat with obviously nothing in the bag but this is what it looks like right here it is absolutely gorgeous you guys look at the strap detail on that it is honestly beautiful it almost reminds me of like a peacock or something and we have the actual bag right here and i love the color of this it's so pretty and i love how it's almost kind of like distressed a little bit it almost looks like faded i don't know i just think it's beautiful hair stuck in my lip we're good <laughs> ah it's so pretty you guys i love this oh my god the strap is also completely adjustable so if you want to make it shorter longer you can definitely do that and this bag is huge you guys you can put a lot of stuff in here it also does have a few different like compartments in there it has these pockets on this side and then it does have a little um a zippered pocket right there as well i feel like it almost kind of gives like western vibes a little bit like western boho a mix of those and quality wise you guys it's so nice it feels like a really good kind of heavy duty bag it doesn't feel like it's gonna like fall apart in two seconds you know what i mean yeah i'm just over the moon with this fine cannot wait to actually use it and i feel like it's gonna be such a good like summer bag okay i was gonna do accessories next but let's switch it up and actually do hair tools so i picked up two i'll show this one first so right now when it comes to hair curlers i only have like a curling wand but i used to like back in the day use one with a clamp and honestly i have no idea what happened to that so i'm like you know what let me go ahead and pick one up because I haven't used one in so long, but I used to love how the curls turned out. So I'm excited to try this. This is what it looks like right here. Let me go ahead and turn it like that. So there you go. That's what it looks like straight out of the package there. And this is what the actual hair tool looks like right there. It's actually a really nice, like decent size. I can't remember what size is. Okay, so it says it's a 32 millimeter. I think there was two different size options you could get. So I went with that one, but that's what it looks like up close there. It actually looks really, really nice and good quality. I love the gold and the white. I think it looks really sleek. And then you have the clamp. It's been a long time since I've used a clamp curler, so wish me luck. <laughs> I might have to watch a few tutorials again and see how it works because I honestly kind of do forget a little bit, but uh, I'm excited to have it. It's by the brand Crass. I've never heard of that. It looks to me like it has a few different settings on it. In the middle, I think it's off but then you can push it down and then you can push it all the way up. So thank goodness it does come with a little instruction manual here. So I'll have to read up on that just to see what the actual settings are. But uh, yeah, I'm really, really excited about this. I can't wait to actually give it a go and try it out. And this was super cheap, you guys. I honestly was not expecting it to look and feel as nice as it does. So yeah, I'm really impressed so far. This one I am so excited about. I've never had a hair tool like this before. So this is what it looks like here. It's one of those like, beach wavers or no they call it a three barrel curling iron but i just call it a beach waver <laughs> obviously i went ahead and got the pink one duh if it comes in pink i'm gonna get it in pink but again like the other one it does come with a little instruction manual but this is what it looks like right here again you guys this is like really nice heavy duty quality i'm very impressed so far like the other hair tool this was super super cheap this is so pretty like i cannot get over how it looks i love that pink um, and that is what it looks like up close there, just in case you guys are curious. And that's the little clamp part. My hair naturally is very wavy. It almost kind of looks like beach waves, except frizzier and messier, not as nice. But <laughs> I'm hoping maybe I could do my hair more natural and just maybe like do a couple of these waves to make it look a little bit more tame, you know what I mean? But yeah, I'm really, really happy that I got this. I'm so excited to try it out and see what it's like. So uh, wish me luck with this one. <laughs> all right, so before we go ahead and get into like all the accessories that I picked up, I want to show you guys kind of like a, a random item that I got, but it's so fun. So for anybody that doesn't know, I do have a dog named Tang. And his vets think he's around 10 years old. So, you know, he's getting up there. He's an older dog, but you never know. He looks like a puppy and he acts like a puppy. But um, with that being said, sometimes when we're out for walks or just around the yard, he does get a little bit tired and he wants to be carried. So I've always wanted to try a dog carrier and I finally got one. So this is what it looks like right here. It's one of those ones that you kind of wear it over your shoulder. And then obviously you put your dog or cat, whatever, inside the little pouch here. And I actually went ahead and I tried this out with him. I'll go ahead and include like a picture or a clip. And he loves it, you guys. Like he did not want to get out of here. This is right up his alley. He loves anything comfy and just, if he's warm and cuddly and like in a blanket or something, 
he loves it. It's actually really nice and big. And then it does have like this print on the inside there. So Tang is a Shih Tzu. I would say he's like a small to medium sized dog and he fits in here perfectly. So yeah, just for reference, if you guys have a dog his size, he, they will probably fit in here. Um, it does also have this little piece right here where I'm assuming you can kind of hook on to their collar, but Tang wears a harness, so I'm probably never going to use that part. Um, but yeah, I just thought this was so cute and fun. <laughs> and will I probably look like a crazy dog lady wearing this? Yes. Do I care? No. But yeah, I think it's actually really cool, especially like I said, if your dog is getting a little bit older and maybe, you know, they slow down a little bit. Um, I think this is really great for them. So yeah. All right, next I got a bunch of different accessories. I just put them all in this bag. First thing, I picked up some heatless curlers. Now these are not like your typical heatless curler. Obviously you can see here, you get three of them. But to be quite honest with you guys, I haven't really worked out how these actually work yet. Um, I've seen a few people use these, but when I tried it, it just, it was not working. So I'm definitely going to have to play around with these a little bit more, but you get three of them like this. And as you guys can see, they do have a clip on this side and that. So basically you go ahead and you hook them like that and your hair is supposed to kind of wrap around like that. They almost look like a little like horseshoe or donut or something. But like I said, the other day I tried these like three or four times and I just could not get them to work with my hair. I don't know if it's because my hair is too thick or what it is, but they just weren't really like holding my hair. They kept kind of falling. So I think I'm just gonna have to go ahead and watch a better tutorial on how to use these because I think with a little bit of practice, I think I could get it, but um, I love heatless curls. That's pretty much all that I do. Whenever I do see different versions of the heatless curler, I always wanna try them out and give them a go. But yeah, like I said, I'm definitely gonna have to play around with these a little bit more. Um, if you guys have ever used these, definitely let me know in the comments down below how you like them. Next, I actually picked up some phone cases. So we'll start with this one first. I've said this in a few videos before, but I really don't have a lot of phone cases. So I've just been trying to build up a little bit of a collection. I honestly can't tell if this is focusing or not, but I just picked this one up right here. It's just plain black, nothing too crazy about it. Just kind of one of those hard rubber cases, but I wanted something just super plain and basic like this because I honestly don't have anything like this. I like this one because it almost looks a little bit protective at the same time. It has this like really thick, outer part on it right here so I feel like it's gonna be a little bit protective seems good quality and it was super cheap oh that actually looks so nice so yeah that's what it looks like on my phone right there all right and this is the other phone case that I picked up and this one might just look plain black but it actually does have a design on it I don't know if you can see it that well on camera but it has like just a bunch of horses and cowboy hats and cowboys and I just thought it was really cute so this one is definitely a lot thinner for sure so I don't think it's gonna be very protective on your phone but it's so cute, I love that. Um, and again, super cheap. Okay, next, I'm excited about this one. They're actually a pair of sunglasses. And if you guys know me, I say this all the time, but I feel like I can never find a good pair of sunglasses that actually suit me. But I've been seeing people wear these like all the time and I love them so I just had to pick them up. So this is what they look like here. I just think they're so cute, this like aviator style. Obviously they're not gonna provide much protection for your eyes, but they're more so kind of just like a, a fashion item, you know what I mean? Now I will say these were incredibly cheap and they definitely are very slight feeling, like they're not metal at all, they are just plastic. So I would say these are probably gonna be a little bit easier to break for sure. They're not, you know, the best quality in the world, but like I said, they were super cheap. You kind of get what you paid for for these. But yeah, I'll probably be mostly wearing these more so for style than anything anyways. So yeah, I do think they're so cute. Okay, next, this one's kind of random, but this is what it looks like right here. So essentially these are kind of like travel on the go little flossers and they come in a case. And you do get two in the pack and obviously they're pink, which I love. I think you could get green or blue too, but you know, I had to go for pink. Um, I don't know how many you get in here. I think maybe 10 in a case, um, but I'm gonna give one to my mom and I'm gonna keep one for myself. But I love having stuff like this in my purse. I honestly feel like it's kind of a must have. If you don't have a little flosser thingy in your purse, what are you doing? You know what I mean? <laughs> and it's also just so adorable as well. Like, look at that, you guys, so cute. I might as well show the other thing that I'm actually giving to my mom, which is this right here. So she loves those like um, big tumblers, like the Stanley dupes. She has a few of them now. And I saw this little set right here. It's almost like a little accessory set for your tumbler. So you get the straw cover right here. It's a cute little pink flower, so adorable. And then what I thought was so cute, I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see it that well on camera, but you get this little charm. And obviously it's a little initial charm. It's almost like a little bracelet for your tumbler. So yeah, you just clip it like that and it hangs on the handle. And I just thought that was so cute. And I don't know if you guys can see on camera, but it is pink. We both love pink. So when I saw this, I knew I had to get it for her and I know she's gonna love this. So lately I've been loving turquoise jewelry. I just think it's beautiful. So I saw this pack of earrings on there and I had to get them. 
look at that up close you guys how stunning are these so you get five different pairs there and as you guys can see there's some turquoise ones there's some just like plain silver hoops here this one is silver and turquoise and i just thought these were absolutely gorgeous just like so western and kind of bohemian and just right up my alley i love it it's so pretty i just can't stop staring at them i love getting packs of earrings like this i prefer getting packs like this over just like you know, a single pair of earrings. And these were super cheap as well, you guys. As I was literally just saying, oh, I don't like to buy like single pairs of earrings. That's what I got. <laughs> but I had to get these. As soon as I saw them, I was like, oh my goodness, these are gorgeous. I don't know if it's gonna focus that well, but these are little tiny starfish and they are so cute. Oh my goodness. They're gold and they have little pearls in them. And I think these would be really cute in like my second piercing, but um, yeah, I love these. Summertime, these are going to be perfect. Okay, I did not realize how many earrings I picked up. So uh, let's try to go through these little rapid fire here. Um, again, another single pack. But these ones just really stood out to me. As soon as I saw them, I was like, oh, Oh, they're pretty and I didn't put them in my cart at first and then I kept like thinking about them like I gotta get them so this is what they look like here they're just a hoop but as you guys can see they have all these like little diamonds on them there and I just thought these were so gorgeous you guys so pretty and I love the size of these hoops as well they're not like crazy big I've been definitely getting like more into jewelry lately with my necklaces and my rings and whatever but there's just something about earrings I just love I have to have earrings in I just think they're so pretty um, I love doing like my ears up with like cuffs and all that so yeah I love adding new earrings to my collection and these are stunning so I think this is the last pack of earrings that I picked up here and these are just kind of like a basic pack of hoops so this is what they look like up close there I don't know if that's focusing that well but this is just like a pack of kind of smaller hoops there are a few different sizes there but they're definitely on the smaller side I love earrings like this because I can wear them in my second piercing and my first and I just think they look so nice. So yeah, I'm definitely good on earrings for a while, but with that being said, will I buy more? Absolutely, especially on Timu. Like, I just feel like they have the best, super cheap, and they're always so cute. Okay, so we have a few more pieces of jewelry, and then we're gonna end it off with a makeup item. So let's get into these next. These are some bracelets. I've been seeing everybody do like a certain stack of bracelets all over TikTok and Pinterest, and I am obsessed with it. Ever since I saw it, I'm like, it's funny because I'm really not a big bracelet person because most of the time they never fit correctly. Like my wrists are so tiny that they just slide right off. So I think you get seven in total here. And I swear everyone's been rocking this bracelet stack and it's so cute. I love it. I think they're fun. And these were again so cheap. And I think they had silver as well, I believe. So I wear a ring all the time um, and it's this one right here. But this is my Cartier ring dupe. I got this off of... I don't even know, but years ago. Um, it was gold, but it's now slightly starting to turn. So I went ahead and I actually picked up another one, but this one's in silver. And I know some people feel like a certain way about designer dupes or fakes, but honestly, I don't care. I don't know if my camera is really picking it up that well, but that is what it looks like right there. It's a little bit thicker than the one I have right now, but um, I actually really like it. So that's my first one on the bottom there, and that is the one that I just got at the top. So that's the size difference there, but I think it's so cute. And last but not least, you guys, I went ahead and picked up a makeup item. I kind of had to go a little bit fast because my camera's dying, but this is a blush. I already went ahead and swatched it just in case you guys see that swatch mark, but it looks so pretty. It looks like it would be powder, but it is actually cream. Let me go ahead and swatch this for you guys. It's such a pretty shade of pink. Like, look at that color, you guys. That is so gorgeous. Like, I think this was only a few dollars, and it's that pigmented. That's crazy. All right, you guys. So that is actually everything in today's Timu haul. Like I said earlier, definitely go ahead and download the Timu app if you want to get more perks. And also check out my link down below for a nice special coupon. But anyways, I hope you guys really enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big like and subscribe because I'd really appreciate that. Also, if you want to go ahead and keep up with me outside of YouTube, I do have TikTok and Instagram, and I'll go ahead and link those down below. So I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.